hello everyone welcome back to my channel prince automation destination this side prince so today we are going to start another interesting series that is interview questions for the test automation engineers as part of this particular series i'll be covering the most widely asked interview questions and their respective solutions so to begin with let us start with our first interview question that is related to amazon.in so when we will land on amazon.in we will see this carousel section where we will see the list of advertisements so the requirement is we want to store images of each each advertisement one by one but the requirement is we should have unique images so what actually is the requirement so we want to get the image of this advertisement then we want to perform click then we want to get the advertisement image of this particular advertisement and likewise we want to store the advertisement images for all the advertisements the real challenge is this is a circular meaning when we will reach to the last advertisement and then we click on this particular arrow icon it will go to the first advertisement right so now let us try to understand from the practical demonstration but before you jump or look into the solution i would request you to please try it on your own to get some good understanding and then come back to this particular solution right so i'm using intellij and in intellij i'm using maven project i have created one maven project and i'm using selenium 4 i have created one class amazon unique images which is having one method and now let us create one instance of web driver web driver driver equal to new chrome driver right if you will observe that i'm not downloading the chrome driver exe and i'm not even setting up the path why because because i'm using selenium 4 and in selenium 4 it has its own capability to download the chrome driver exe based on the chrome browser installed in your system in case you are not aware how it internally works i would request you to please check out my video where i have already covered this i'll be sharing the link of same in the i icon now the next thing is we need to launch the amazon.in right so for that purpose we'll be using driver.get and now we will go to amazon.in and i'll provide the url right now the next thing is we need to get the locator of this particular image so i'm going to right click and going to inspect right and you will see that for image we have one img tag that is html tag and in this we have src this src is nothing but the source of image right if you will try to hit this particular image url we will see this particular advertisement right now let us try to locate this particular image okay before that let us try to scroll and try to look for the hierarchy right if you will see that these all advertisements fall under one ol which stands for ordered list right and if you will observe the one which is available currently will have style parameter and that will have visibility equal to visible for rest of the advertisements visibility would be hidden right so this is how we will construct the x path ol then li right now we have reached till here the next thing is we are going to use style parameter right at the rate style comma visible right so this is how we can reach till this particular advertisement which is available or visible currently right now we need to navigate to the image right so we have got this particular locator let us try to put it here right and the next thing is we need to get the element for this particular thing right get the locator for this particular icon right so this is the class so what i'm going to do i and add the red class and this is how we can get the element locator for this particular element and let me put it here right make sure that after launching this particular url you maximize it right so driver dot manage dot window dot maximize right now as we need to store the unique images right and for images as we just discussed that we have src attribute which is a string and in order to store unique element in java we have one collection that is set and as we are going to store the strings so let us create one set of string unique images and let us create object of hash set right once we have done this now now the next challenge is how many times we need to click on this so when we are not certain that how many times we need to click on a particular element or how many times we need to run the loop so in such cases we go by the concept of flag 
okay so we will create one flag boolean started equal to true right and then after what we will do is while started which will be true and then what we will do is driver dot find element by dot xpath first of all we will start clicking on this particular element right dot click next thing is after clicking on this we will get the url right image url how we will get that driver dot find element and we are going to use this particular element this time because we want to get the image element driver dot find element right but by dot xpath first because we are using xpath locator so let us copy this and put it into this particular section and then after we need to get the source as attribute so get attribute src right so this is what is the attribute for image right now we have got the image next thing is we will check in the hash set or the set unique images dot contains whether it has already this particular url or not if it is already available what we will do is we will mark this started flag as false and by this what will happen is it will go outside from this particular loop so while unique if sorry it would be if unique images dot contains image url then started equal to false else what we will do is we will add this particular url into the unique images set right and to confirm this what we will do is we will come outside this particular while loop and we will print the size of unique images which should be 5 which should be 8 sorry and also what we will do is we will print the images as well right now let us try to run this So it will launch amazon.in it will maximize this particular window and it will start clicking on this and will start using it okay now if i go here i will see that i have eight advertisements right so this is how we can store the unique images right so these are the different images which are separated by comma because we are directly printing the images uh, unique images set right so this is first image so if i click on this i will get the first image right so this is the first image right likewise if i click on second i will see the second image right so this is how we can store the unique images from the carousel section of amazon.in it's tricky one i would suggest please give it a try and this is what i wanted to cover as part of this video thank you for watching i would request you to please stay tuned for more such videos and would request you to please like share and subscribe thank you once again